So in this Canva tutorial video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to save as a JPG file or a JPEG file here on Canva. So the uh, first thing you have to do is design your Im or design your design uh, or design your image. Uh, basically, however you want to design it, it doesn't really matter. Um, just for the sake of this video, I'm just going to create something super quick. How about a square? Uh, I'm going to make it pretty large. I'll make it more of a rectangle. Uh, I'm just going to change the square color to black. I'm going to change the background to red uh, or change it to green. And there you go. Uh, let's just say this is my wonderful design, my masterpiece, and I want to save it as a JPG file. Uh, pretty helpful actually for YouTube thumbnails in case you are uh, looking to create a high quality image with a lower file size. Um, so what, you, what I want you to do now is go to where it says share. I want you to press on share. Then I want you to press on download. Uh, then I want you to go to where it says file type and press on that and go to where it says JPG best for sharing that I want you to press on that. Uh, now you do have a bunch of different options here. Um, in regards to size, I can make it 1920 by 1080, which is a perfectly good size to me. Uh, but if you wanna make it larger, you can slide it to the right. If you wanna make it smaller, you can slide it to the left. Basically play with it however you want. Uh, also to quality, right? This is important for saving um, in regards to how big the file is. Now, uh, I personally always just drag this bar to the left. Um, I noticed that this is always below 2 MB, which is always good for YouTube thumbnail. Uh, and the file size actually isn't that large, despite the fact that it does say large. Uh, but of course, if you want to make it a little bit smaller, you can change the quality, making it smaller as well. But I always just set to 100 uh, and then press download. It'll take a couple seconds and just download this to your laptop or to your computer. So uh, Hopefully this video helped. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next one.